M Aggies up on the right side of your screen in lane two and three, Connor Schulman and Jaqualin Scott. <laughs> Dean and Brackens with great starts. They are stride for stride, but Dean now with a little bit of a crack, but here comes Brackens. I'm not sure who leaned it out first. I'm giving it to Dean. And if they do that, 10 more points for the Red Raiders. Not only did they get most of their people through yesterday, he got it. They're also performing today. They got 19 points from their three athletes in the 60 meter final. And now Caleb Dean comes back and takes the hurdle title and 10 points for the Red Raiders. Well, Caleb Dean had a little trouble with the schedule yesterday because he usually runs the hurdles first and then he goes to the 60. But look at him out lean Johnny Brackens there. Caleb Dean smashed the fourth hurdle. Johnny Brackens hit the last hurdle and that's what let Caleb Dean get to the line. But a good start, real solid. There you see Caleb Dean, seven strider to the first hurdle. Johnny Brackens is a very clean hurdler, but he hit hurdles along the way. But look at Caleb Dean come off that last hurdle. He was the one who was square. Wow, Johnny Brackens was just lucky to be standing after that fifth hurdle. But good running by the Texas Tech Red Raider, and he came through with big points. First title for Tech in the hurdles indoors. And there are the official results. Look at that. One-tenth of a second, one-one-hundredth of a second, I should say, over Brackens and 